The first Friday of each month, Park Street through Victory Drive in downtown Savannah transform themselves from mere streets to venues for an eclectic range of artistic works. Art Rise Savannah's Art March brings artisans, businesses, and community members together for public displays of creativity. I'd say of all the programs that Art Rise Savannah does, the Art March is most about community accessibility. Um, we really focus a lot on keeping it free. A $5,000 grant from Georgia Council for the Arts is helping the Art March expand their vendor selections and attract new faces. This is my first time and I'm really enjoying it. This is really cool. I'm having a great time. Ohio native and painter Blake Daniels will soon be taking his artistic endeavors to South Africa. He says his canvas has traveled the world, but there's no place like Savannah. The community around it, you know, it's something that's great about the city is like, as the person having a show, you, you'll text everybody like, hey, I hope to see you tonight at the show opening, you know, and it's, it's a very tight network, tight network group of people. And I just have found, of all the places I've lived, something about Savannah, Georgia is just very particular and peculiar. Daniel says this mixture of peculiarity and beauty has led him to appreciate the pauses in life. For me, it's about like stopping these like moments that often get pushed by or don't get acknowledged and actually looking at all the like layers that happen beneath them. But it isn't just traditional art forms on display at the march. Pendants are formed in front of buyers' eyes. So Michael White's just blowing some glass here. And a statue made of discarded items lends a hand in adding to the variety Art March and Savannah are known for. A young lady who lives around this neighborhood, um, she came and sort of fell into the Art March one night. Didn't really plan on coming to it, but but found herself in the middle of this crazy market and there was music and there was live painting and there were lights and there was kids and adults and everybody was having a great time. And she um, seeked us out, one of us, and she told us, I didn't know this was possible in my community. Artistic creations remain on display throughout each week before a new set of exhibits makes their debut at the beginning of each month. In Savannah, Gabrielle Ware, GPB News.